Hi, I'm Matt Allen, owner of Virginia Auto Service and host of Bumper to Bumper Radio, heard every single Saturday at 11, right here on 92.3 KTAR. Bumper to Bumper Radio is a show to help you, the motoring public, have a better overall car ownership and repair experience, whether it's mechanical repairs, collision repairs, tires, we've got you covered. And today, we've got the team from Bumper to Bumper Radio we call the Collision Team. Leo Petrozola from Campus Body Salon. We have Dave Lingram from First Class Auto Body and Kevin Rowe from I-17 Collision Repair. Thanks for joining us, guys. Thanks, Thank man. you. Okay, you had the car accident, but you're the lucky one. Your car didn't get towed to, to Never Never Land. Your car is still drivable. It's not leaking any fluids. The lights aren't broken, but it's not very pretty. Now we need to get the car fixed. Leo, where do we start? Where does the where does the consumer start? Uh, that process how do we where do we go what do we do so again um, obviously our hope and advice is that you would go in and download the app you'll have the information for our three facilities uh, contact any one of the three of us um, you're going to want to contact your insurance company as well um, in a case like that uh, what we're seeing especially due to technology is a lot of the insurance companies are going to what's called a photo app uh, where you actually, they will send you the information. You could download that right on your phone. It takes just about five minutes for you to go around and take the series of photos. Mm -hmm. It's very, it's actually a really cool program. Right. Um, it's very mm -hmm. easy for them to follow it and provide all the information that they need. That gets sent up to the insurance company. It's reviewed by an individual who then generates an initial estimate. And I think that's the key word that you need to focus on because most people they'll receive that estimate back and they'll go there's no way this is going to fix my car it's not and you don't have to worry it, yeah, about that that's just because again obvious. that's just where yep. you know we mm -hmm. will then come in and we administrate that claim for you with the mm -hmm. insurance company we're going to take their initial estimate and as we start to do any disassembly find any further damage items that they missed as part of the repair mm -hmm. process we're going to contact them for a supplement the insurance companies pay it all of the time. There's right. no question about paying for something that legitimately needs to be done to repair the car mm -hmm. back to pre-accident condition. Right. And you said the keyword is supplemental repair, and you're right. That initial estimate, I think it's, is it safe to say it's just a conversation starter? It's something yeah, that's that, a good way to that you guys yeah. can see before the car arrives mm -hmm. to you. Yeah, this this is this this is what we're we're faced with. This kind type of damage mm -hmm. just gives you a little preview. But again, once you start disassembling, then you then you can find w if there's hidden damage yep. and stuff. And Kevin, that's called a supplemental mm -hmm. repair. Yeah, it's so common because the pictures you can only just see so much unless mm -hmm. right. You know, in our industry, there's just so much that's hidden that you do have to do to the disassembly, and then you do the supplement process with the insurance right. companies, mm -hmm. and that's all that happens on 99.9% .9 of every insurance claim that we have anyway. Because <laughs> yeah. Dave, so, I mean, you can't you can't just look at a picture and know no. everything's wrong with the car. There's no. disassembly, and, and hey, they might right get. Does it happen? They get started, and then maybe the the cars. Well, not in this case necessarily because this car drove in. But sometimes you don't even know if the car's totaled until you really start. Mm -hmm. I mean, you have to mm -hmm. take it apart to expose that damage, right? Yeah, we recently had an Audi that was drivable, looked like it's hardly been damaged. Mm -hmm. We disassembled it down to 100% teardown and discovered that the frame was bent, had suspension damage, broke the engine cradle. The engine was displaced from the incident, <clears throat> and uh, it eventually totaled. Right. We're in the business to fix cars, but ultimately we're in the business to do what's best for the customer. Mm -hmm. And all of us on this team, we're owners. Nobody cares like an owner. That's right. <laughs> you can go to a big box body shop. They are just representing the corporation that runs it, but they don't own the business. We own the business. If you own a car, you care for it. If you rent a car, you don't care for it, right? <laughs> Drive it like a rental car, right? <laughs>